couple weeks ago they had a grass fire. Captain Keith Wade with the Sacramento Fire Department says more firefighters will be staffed this weekend with a red flag warning. What we always have people do early in the season is to control that vegetation and growth around their homes, uh, uh, do a what we call a defensible space. Here in the city, you know, five to ten feet, uh, anything helps. That work, Captain Wade adds, should already have been done, as mowing and other yard work is highly discouraged during red flag mornings, both by the city's fire department and Cal Fire. Man's ability to cause fires is a concern, especially when the fire danger is heightened. If you're towing something, if you're towing your boat and going to the lake this weekend to go have fun, make sure your chain is not dragging. That, that chain dragging on the ground at 70 miles, 65 miles per hour uh, can spark and cause a fire. The latest stats from Cal Fire come from 2016. While 760 of the more than 28 wildfires that year had an undetermined cause, 380 were started by people burning debris, another 281 by vehicles, and 270 by electrical power. Anyone is thinking, oh, this, I'm going to go out and burn my, my brush, that's, that, that again is what we call a no-no. Fireworks in the days ahead are a concern too, and Fire Marshal Jason Lee stresses you set them off away from dry grass and tall brush. Normally we like to see maybe in a driveway or a street or sidewalk areas, and then always make sure to have a, either a water hose nearby or a water bucket. Sacramento Fire plans to increase staff for July 4th as well.